Okay, so now let's talk about why you should use the new formats. The most important reason is the long period sustainability. Questionnaire data is the kind of data that will grow over time and it's important to keep it under control. In this table, I have listed four storage types for questionnaires. The first two are legacy JSON and the next two are the new JSON storage types. You can see that for one completed questionnaire, the difference in storage size is only a few kilobytes, but as the number of completed questionnaire grows and we get to 100,000, the storage size difference is two gigabytes. This data is based on a simple questionnaire that uh, Timote has created, but it will be very similar for any given questionnaire. So think in advance. When you are designing and configuring a new questionnaire template, uh, try to answer these questions. How big is the questionnaire's data footprint? How many questionnaires will be produced in a month, in a year, etc.? And eventually, how much storage will questionnaire data take up on the server in one year time, in two years time, in three years time? Based on that, you should be able to decide what questionnaire format to use in your case so that the data size will not get out of control. You also might consider some retention policy for the questionnaire data.